Good morning, I'm Mrs. Dina Cola, and this is my fifth grade class at Cheedy Grove Elementary, and today we're going to be working on science. All right, today, boys and girls, we're going to be creating a prototype of a roller coaster. King's Dominion is looking to design a new roller coaster. <clears throat> we need you to develop a prototype for the ride. Use what you know about the properties of force, motion, and gravity to build a structure that has a track on which a marble can travel. Your design must have one loop or a complete circle. That's for five points. Measure how tall it is, two points each, and you have to measure in centimeters. Two 90 degree angles, that's three points. And the marble needs to land in the container at the end of the ride, all right? At the bottom of your materials, we'll talk about that in a minute. Um, we talked about force and motion. What are some words that we need to know? What's kinetic? What does kinetic mean? What's kinetic? Yes. In motion. In motion. All right. What's potential? Where's potential at? Gabriella. It means that it's not moving. It's about to happen because it has potential. Okay. What's speed? What is speed? Like how fast it's going. Okay. How fast or? Slow. Slow. All right. What is mass? How much it weighs and how much what is inside of it? Volume. Matthew. Volume. Volume. Something Volume. else. Uh, matter. Matter. Mass. Right? How much matter is in there? All right. What is friction? You can tell me what friction is. What is friction? Nihon. Uh, the two surfaces rubbing against each other. Okay. The two surfaces rub together. Does that make objects go faster or slower? Slower. Well, okay. All right, and what, is there any other words you can think of? What about collide? What does collide mean? What does collide mean? Ben. Okay, they go up, they bounce back, something to that effect. All right, so we're each gonna get, each table's gonna get a basket that has your supplies in it. As you can see, you only get the supplies that have numbers by them, that's all you get. <laughs> Two rubber bands, 10 straws, 10 popsicle sticks, 10 pipe cleaners, index cards, paper, masking tape, a piece of sandpaper, two cotton balls, two paper cups, two paper plates, paper clips, string, cardboard tubes, six feet of foam, insulation, one marble, one glue stick, scissors, and markers. And you will get started when you get your basket. Go ahead and get started. It's on you. Start designing. Look, you already have your design papers made that we did on Friday. Let's get it together. hard to go up. Don't have anything to pull it up. Okay. All right. And so what are you going to do with the foam? Okay. And then what? Okay. All right. All right. Get started. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Okay, so circle's going to go around. Are you going to start high or low for your circle? Oh, I guess lower and then go higher. Okay. Or higher than lower. Well, what do you think? Higher or lower or lower than higher? Yeah, we can go higher because that would be easier. Okay, why is that easy? Because if we're only using gravity, we need to, like, set it high because then it will fall down and get... And have a higher speed? Yeah, yeah. higher speed. Okay. All right. Sounds like a plan. We're already making some stuff. What do we got? So what are we doing here? So we have like hard scissors so we can make the path Okay. But we don't have it. Okay, I'll get you a pair. What else? So you're going to use, show me what you're going to do there. Okay. Okay. So how are you going to make the loop, Andrew? How do you make the loop? Okay. All right. Brady, what do you? What's the, what's your favorite part of that? Be what? The loop? Okay, how do you think the loop's gonna work? How are we gonna get it to go up and around in the loop? Okay, so it comes down really fast. Yeah. Okay. All right. What's your job here, Abina? The loop. Everyone's going to work on the loop. All right. Let's get started. I think that'll try it. Oh. Yeah, try it. Oh, yeah, it will. Try it. It's perfect. Yeah, so then it'll rip up. It'll, yeah, just go straight down. It'll go. All right. So what are you going to do with that? That's oh, our side. We're going to make our loop loop. Okay. And we're also going to use this as a side. So oh, we can add this too so we can oh, yeah. make it more secure. No. Okay. Yeah, that's not going to be how it works now. Because this is a that. So we're just going to turn it into our loopy loop. Okay. Okay. You can make a bigger piece. No Okay, so what are we doing here? So we're just basically planning out where we're going to use all the materials. Okay, so what do you think you're going to do? So we're going to use like this like big tube to like make it where like you drop in. Okay. And then like probably around like right here. We are going to use paper plate, but I don't think we have one. Okay. And then it's going to come down. What are those shoes? Yeah. You can use this, right? You can use that instead of the paper plate. Okay. It will, like, right there, and then, like, slow it down and let it into the cup. Okay. How are you going to slow it down? Um, it's going to be, like, just, like, straight away and so, like, go down to make it faster. Uh-huh. And then it's going to hit, hit, like, that kind of low. Okay. Okay. So what are we going to use? What material in here could we use to slow it down? Um, we could use the sandpaper. The sandpaper? Okay. Why would the sandpaper work? It's kind of rough and the marble will Okay. So All right. What else? Anything else in here? Okay. How would the index card work? So we can make a turn and it would hit like the index part and then go in into this tube. Oh, keep on going down. Okay, so that's your 90 degree angle? Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, so what happens with the 90 degree angle? What's the marble going to do? If you hit it, and then it's going to like go back and then back in. Okay, alright. Okay, what's it called when two things hit? 
Uh, colliding? Oh, collision. Collision. Colliding. All right. When the marble sits there, what's, what, what is it doing when it just sits there? Okay, when it moves, what is it? Okay, so what would the volcano do? It would push it. Okay, it would be the force to make the marble what? Move. Move. What's it called when it moves? When it's in motion. Kinetic. I'm sorry, that was my fault. All right, so we can pretend that the volcano is there and we can move forward. How about that? Yeah. Okay, you ready? Let's take it. Get the cup. Okay, yeah. Hold it. You're going to work like this. No. Should we apply? Do it. Oh, there it goes. Okay, we didn't take this before. Okay. It bounced out, so it bounced too fast. So put it in the slower now. I just saw a picture of you. No, it was on my mom's This. So I need like four. Four? No, this one. It has to kind of be freestanding, meaning it stands by itself. So, where would the best position be for you to set it? Where would the best position be? Higher or lower? Didn't you just say? What did you just say? You said lower? Okay. Why would we want, where's the lowest part in the room? The floor. So where would probably the best part when you're running, doing your test runs, where would be the best place to put it? The floor. On the floor. Okay. All right, do it again. Move your hand. Let's see it. Okay, so maybe not. How would you adjust that? What? Okay. Okay, so what are you going to do? What are you cutting here? Uh huh. Oh, okay. And you think sandpaper will help that? Yeah. Make it smaller. Okay. All right. Um, let's take a quick break here. Sit down for a second and look here. What are some of the challenges that you're having? What are some of the things that you're really having to have to work on? Sammy. Like, when, like, the drop, you have to make it go faster, like, and, like, um, you can't, like, pull it, do, like, do it diagonal like that. Okay, so you have to make it, what is that, flatter, top? Like, uh, more, like, flat. Okay. All right, James. So we can't hold, like, all the roller coasters and so Okay, so how are you going to prop it up with the what? With the masking tape? What else would you? Okay, so you made your loop and you used masking tape to hold the loop together. Okay, all right. What else? What kind of challenges are you guys having? Okay, all right. And Mason, what about your group? You and Nihon and Aradia. Uh-huh. Okay, so the tape's not working good enough? Okay, maybe you need a different type of tape, something a little bit more stickier? Okay, what about you guys back here? What kind of challenges are you having? Like, we don't know if the marble will like, fit through from here to here. Okay. All right, so fitting is an issue. All right, who has made some adaptation some changes to theirs since they started what are some changes you've made liam uh, 
Oh, we made the like uh, hills taller. Okay, you made your hills taller. Um, we cut we cut the um hole in half. Like we made like like a full one is like this, so we cut it in half so we can have more space for the marble. Okay, so then more space for the marble. All right, so you cut it in half. Is it easier or harder to work with with it cut in half? Um, I feel it's easier because uh, when I was together, it was kind of hard to like shape it or something. Okay. Yeah. All right. So one thing that you solved is it's easier to manipulate it when it's cut in half. It's not as hard. Okay, Lanya. Okay. All right, so the cardboard shapes weren't sturdy enough, strong enough, or were they? The foam was better. The foam was better, okay. All right, James. Um, we didn't have enough of a loop, and it was hard to make one, so we had to like, tape it with masking tape. Okay, all right. What about you guys, anything? What do you, did you make your loop? Let me see your loop. That's your loop? Okay. All right, now, what are some things, talk with your group right now on some things after you've seen what other people are doing and heard what other people are doing. What are some changes you want to make right now? Talk with your group. Thank you very much for coming and spending some time with us today as we work through science, and we enjoy having you in our classroom. Go Cardinals!